and JJ approved because, you know, when I was a kid, I used to go down south and go to the beach and run around fields down south of Georgia and Florida, North Carolina, South Carolina, you know. You know, I don't, I don't consider myself Southern, but what I do know is I learned a lot of roots. And I learned a lot about what I wanted to do musically down south. And, uh, you know, this song kind of epitomizes things that people lose you know, over over a period of time. And, uh, you know, JJ wrote this song because he came from a little town in Florida called La Cusa. And, uh, you know, JJ was tired of seeing Walmarts and Kmarts and Nordstrom's and Disney Park Resorts come up, you know? What happened to just going over to your buddy's house and sitting in a field with a bonfire and smoking a little weed and drinking a little whiskey? And, you know, some Budweiser? You know, so this song kind of epitomizes all that. And you love it with all your heart. That's kind of where this song comes from. And me and Mike actually asked JJ once. He said, JJ, can we play your song? He said, yeah, I don't give a shit. You can play my song. He said, but can we put meaning into it from where we come from? And he said, yeah, absolutely. No, no love. Do it. Do it, do it, do it. So you know, we like to play this because... But it lets us kind of get back to what we come from, what we enjoy doing. That's just being humble, right? So this song's called La Cusa. And I think you guys will like it if you haven't heard it.
Oh, man, you see my nipples? I can see your nipples. Oh, I can see your nipples. When I see my own nipples, like a nurse. 